colorful shoes. Mr. Lewis, girls, I have some good news for you inside this envelope. Your PE teacher has asked me to give you these. Give this to your parents. Don't open it. Back at Jen's house. Dad, quick, open this. Mr. Lewis says there's good news inside. Say hello to me first, Jen. Your PE teacher is starting football lessons for you girls next week. Wow! Real football? I can score 15 goals. Oh, yes, you can. The school will lend you each a ball to practice in the evenings. Great. And? Well, let me see. Each child will need an old t-shirt, a pair of shorts and socks. What about a jersey and shoes with studs? Can I have a real football strip? Jen begs her father while he reads on. Mmm, no, sorry, except for shoes. Mr. Lewis wants you all to have new shoes. We'll go to the market tomorrow to look for a good pair. No real football things? Back in her room, Jen thinks to herself. I'm going to make sure Dad buys football shoes, proper ones. Then I can score goals just the way FIFA heroes do. I bet the FIFA champions always had proper football boots with studs. I bet they didn't have to wear just any shoes. Want to play, Jen? No, Tessie, not today. Dad and I are off to buy new football shoes. We've got ours already. Jen and her dad arrive at the market. A shopkeeper calls out loudly. Get your shoes here! Running shoes, football shoes, shoes for every sport, all sizes, all colors. Cheap shoes here, red, green, yellow, they don't cost much. No thanks, I'm going to start football lessons next week. I'm buying real football shoes with studs, like the ones champions wear. Jen and her father go to many big shoe shops. They try on many shoes. But none of them seemed to fit right. Either the size was not right, or they were very expensive. Jen's father realizes that they cannot afford shoes at the store. We'll just have to get a pair of those colorful shoes from that man we crossed some time ago. The colors are lovely. I'm sure you'll like them better than these costly ones. Oh, Dad, but they don't have studs on the outsole. I'll never become a famous footballer. Costly shoes don't make great footballers, Jen. Hard work and intelligence do. Welcome, sir and ma'am. I knew you'd come back. Nowhere in this entire world will you find shoes like you'll find here. I have just the right pair for you. They are just the right kind to learn to kick a ball well. A perfect fit. I wish they were real football shoes. It's Monday afternoon. The class is waiting for their first lesson. But Jen doesn't want to wear her shoes. Okay, class. There's a box of shin pads. Find a pair that fit you. Then put on your football things and report to the field. Hurry. Get in line, everyone. Your shoes are just like mine. Yes, and the same as Pam's and Tessie's and Shirley's. Five children in similar shoes. This must be a record. And we all live on Backstreet. Then you must all play for the same team. You can be the Backstreet Heroes. The Backstreet Heroes win the match. The heroes are the champions. And Jen, you have already scored five goals. Jen cleans her new football shoes in her backyard. I will become a FIFA hero. Yes, I will.